Now, any pet parent will tell you that pet ownership is a chore of love. It's never easy and it's always worth it. There are many things though to worry about. Licensing fees, obedience school, vet bills, and one local family understands the struggle all too well. They're sharing their story about a common weed that's actually causing a life or death situation for two of their dogs. Hopefully they share the story to stop it from happening to anyone else. Our Trent Croce explains. When J.R. Miozga saw someone across the street on a tractor in the field, he thought nothing of it from his Perrysburg home. But now, his 4th of July plans with his wife and two daughters have gone downward after he says his two dogs ingested foxtail barley. The seed has little barbs on it, and the barbs are what dig its way into the throat lining and the stomach lining of, of dogs and other animals. Foxtail barley is considered an invasive weed. It can spread rapidly, and when it affects dogs, owners should watch out for swollen feet, and if a dog is licking their toes, foxtails in their ears that may cause tilting to one side and scratching, foxtail in the eyes that can cause redness and swelling, and if it gets into the dog's nose, watch for fits of sneezing. But for Miozga's dogs, they may have ingested it. So after taking them to a vet in Columbus, they concluded they both are in possible need of surgery. And so we're just, we're still processing it. A neighbor of Miozga explains that a farmer tried to kill the weed prior to planting, but it soon grew out of control. But after he planted, about a month after the spraying, which he planted just about two weeks ago, tomorrow will be two weeks, he, uh, it has all blown into several neighborhoods. Miozga says he's reserving judgment, but he's concerned about what led up to the toxic weed blowing into his backyard, affecting his beloved dogs. My understanding is the farmer may not be the person that owns the land and just rents it from them. It's a part the owner of the land that, you know, should be maintaining the land. In Perrysburg, Trent Croce, WTOL 11. We do have an update on the medical condition for one of the dogs. A veterinarian had to take out actually 15 pieces of foxtail from a dog's throat. The owners say that their vet bill, again, could be close to $5,000. We have reached out to the property owner as well as Perrysburg City officials. And, of course, as we hear back from them, we'll update you on air as well as on our app at WTOL News.